हेलो गुड मॉर्निंग गुड इवनिंग टुडे वी हैव अ मल्टीपल गिव न्यूज फॉर यू प्राइस रिडक्शन इन मल्टीपल ग्राफिक कार्ड्स इन द मार्केट एंड नाउ यू कैन इनेबल द रिसाइजेबल बार एवरी सीपीओ एंड जीपीओ कॉम्बो लेट्स डिस्कस टू डेज हॉट न्यूज ऑन द इंटरनेट लेट्स स्टार्ट इट फ्रॉम द न्यूज अबाउट द एफ एस आर थ्री नाउ द एफ एस आर थ्री विद फ्रेम जनरेशन इज रोल्ड आउट इन द पीट वर्जन ऑफ स्टार फील्ड यू कैन चेक इट आउट इफ स्पेशली ऑन द स्टीम इफ यूर यूजिंग द स्टीम वर्जन एंड यू कैन यूज द पीट वर्जन यू कैन experience this fsr3 officially along with frame generation so this is a very quick news and this was announced by the petesta at uh, twitter known as a and known as an x so you can check it out if you want to and the good news is that fsr3 is going rapidly now it's available in 12 titles officially i'm not considering any kind of third party mod but if you consider third party mods that's mean it's available in like hundreds of the titles but officially it's available in 12 titles and considering the adaptation of fsr2 i believe fsr3 will be available in more titles more quickly as as it is expected and the next thing is the nvidia true hdr mod is available in for the rtx gpus it is shipped with the new driver updates it will automatically switch your uh, standard dynamic range to the hdr using rtx even in this image i can see one major problem that is uh, on the right side we have an uh, r2 hdr is enabled i can see an overexposed lighting over here i don't know how it is working but might be the same as an r2 hdr filter that is already available in the nvidia filters more details will be coming in the near future as more people are going to test it out next update is very important to discuss our community member has overclocked our ram for our apus to whopping 10600 mega transfers per second bro that is insane the ram that was used was clocked at 70 800 mega transfer that was uh, came, that comes from a G skill Trident Z5 memory and they overclock 10600 mega transfer without using any kind of exotic cooling system so that is very uh, important this also tells that in near future how ram speed is going to be evolved that is really important development to know you can check out the more details the link will be in the description down below and next is another good news that news is you can use the resizable bar in every cpu and gpu combo even you can use this with your i5 third generation like i5 34 Uh, 70 or something you know or you can also use with the rx 580 probably a uh, 6 to 7 years old cards although this is not an official sport this is an a uh, ufi mod it means someone are uh, developed a uh, bios mod that you can uh, after installing it allows your system to use the resizable bar so in in this case they used core i3 3470 i think this is core i5 3470 uh, and they paired it with the rx 580 resizable bar for both cpu and gpu is not supported officially but they made it happen with the ufi mod the performance uplift was 12% which is noticeable and considerably really impressive this is also proves that resizable bar is possible with older generation cpus and gpus but the manufacturer chose not to provide us so that is kind of bummer but if you want to try this try it at own your risk because this ui5 is is made by a uh, community members a third party member so it includes kind of different risks and the last two this are about the gpu price drop remember in my recent videos i told you that the gpu discounts and price drops are going to be a new normal in 2024 this news proved my point that i was correct let me show you this rx 7700 xt which was launched at 449 recently but it dropped to 353 a whopping about 100 dollar discount but it is not an official price drop it is a part of promotion but i believe that is going to be normal 350 is going to be new msrp for this gpu because team red had to tackle the uh, team green and this is the year where team green and team red will play aggressively in the price segment let me tell you that rx 7700 xt which is almost 13% faster than rtx 4060 ti 16 gig but it comes with the less price 
that RTX 4060 Ti 16 gig comes at $500 but it's now uh, like RX 7700 XT is now dropped to 353 so that is really important if some of you are looking for a really decent GPU that can you last a 1440p and can that can you last for uh next couple of one two years so you can consider this gpu and now this is a good time to buy this gpu and next news is also very important now the rx 7900 xt is dropped to whopping 699 but its original msrp was 899 it was 900 dollar card and it's now available 200 less it's selling on 700 dollars probably this is answer to rtx 40 70 ti super launch and rtx 40 80 super launch remember this cpu rx 7900 xt is faster than rtx 4070 ti it's a faster about three percent but it is cheaper at the same time it's available on 700 dollars now and i believe this trend is going to be normal in upcoming months because I, uh, as i mentioned already now this is the time to play aggressively in the price segment both for the team red and team green and this thing this competition is really really beneficial for the consumer part this is really beneficial for us this is beneficial for you this is the beneficial for every gamer we can get hands on a good gpus just like this this rx 7900 xt was a 900 dollar card but it is now available on 700 dollar probably this is going to be drop more in the near future no who knows that was today's hot news to let me know what you think about this i'm trying to improve myself if you still are here i have just one small request more than 98 percent of people who watch my video do not subscribe just subscribe to my channel so we can grow as a youtube community to let me know what you think about this video if you like it just leave a like i am setting a target of just five likes on this video i'll see you in the next video till then bye